Why, hello there, everybody. It is I, Super Paul Games. Welcome back to Star Wars Rebellion. I don't remember exactly where we are. Oh, yeah, we got our butts kicked, and the fleet's retreating to Avarum. It will be there on day 316 in four days, or turns, or whatever. What we did do is we damaged the Judicator, where you can see that little X there. It means it can't do hyperspace. It is stuck there until it's repaired. So that's going to make it less likely that they're going to chase us. My mission to Praceline worked! Alright, good job, Jen. Don't, Dan, it didn't. Where were you, Praceline? Okay. We have a fleet going to P P Fash. Oh, wait, it is there. Did it get there last time? Alright, Admiral. Dr oh, wait, we were waiting for Waves. Wavos. Butt. Monster. To get there. <laughs> Alright. And what is going on in Gorman? We've got two fleet carriers going that way. They will arrive there. One will be there momentarily. The other one will be there in 17 days. So we need to get some fighter craft over there. So we're going to take them and transfer them from Yuvina. We don't want this one because you can see the little ion jets there. That means it's in transit. We wouldn't be able to tell it to move anyway. So we need two more. So we'll take Y-Wings. We'll do a confirmed move to Gorman. It would have been nice to have those in our previous assault to have a lot more fighters. Speaking of which, I think all of our fighters got destroyed in this fleet, didn't they? Yeah, we have eight more slots available. Uh, do we have any fighters here? No, we have a bunch on the way, though. So we're going to just send all these guys that can to Gorman. Still not going to be enough. We need more fighters, and we need them stat. We will build some more here. We'll build a few A-Wings. They're adorable. And I think that's an important thing when you're building a ship to make sure it's adorable. Can I assist you? Shut up is what you can do, C-3PO. I'm talking about A-Wings. Good enough. Certainly. While we are at it, let's see if there are any. Let's see if I can hit the wrong button. And I did. Let's see if I can find any idle shipyards. Oh, man, they're all over the place now. We will have these guys build some Y-Wings there. The reason I want Y-Wings is... Uh, let me see if I can find them. Where the fuck are they? Oh, I should use the alphabet. They have ion cannons, which help knock down shields. He's like, I figured out troops. Good for you. Units arrive at Bafash. Next wing. Not the most important things. Orbital shipyard deployed at Kaminar. And they are busy building X wings for a fleet somewhere. Alright, in the far fin sector, Wistral is done. So we will have them on Freitas build. Oops, wrong thing. We'll have them build a few Y wings. How is the fleet here in Freitas? There's the butt jammer. The Palpatine sucks. Some escort carriers. Speaking of which, I had a couple more names people wanted to use. This escort carrier is here, so we will rename it the the Narwhal. Did I spell that right? I think so. It doesn't look right, but that's the way they wrote it, so I think that's right. And then we're going to rename this one. Can I not rename it? Oh, I can't rename it because it's in transit. Uh, we have some Nebulon B frigates that are going to be built here. I have no idea where we're constructing those. What do we have fleet-wise here, too? Oh, the fleet is damaged. Holy land of Dong. The Michigan's damaged. The Kasiria is damaged. In fact, if anything, we want to get as many fighters as we can here post-haste anyway. Can I assist you? We're actually sending them to Uvina. Bring some more Y-Wings. Certainly. It's going to take a while to get them all there, but by the time they get there, we should have an overwhelming advantage. Some were really good building those. How can I assist you? Certainly. And that might be... No, we still have a couple shipyards available. That's why they're bright red there. So what's the fleet at Delaya? The Marzik, the Yoda, the Baby Nofak. We will rename this one. 
This will be the one and done. Classy. The second fleet. Oh, we can fit some more fighters on here. Put a Y wing and another Y wing. Is this fleet ready to go do things? Yeah, it's got a bunch of Corellian Corvettes. Probably could rename this one too. What? What? What are two? What do you want? We're gonna call it the Jabba's Balls. Because nobody wants to mess with Jabba's Balls. <laughs> Classy names all around. I have never used such kind of like creepy names before, except for this way. You're like, sure you. Sure, Super Paul. Didn't we have some officers for this? No. We have a Lion's Garrison unit we can't put on there. I don't think these guys have any stuff for troop transports. We will... Which one of these has more shipyards? They're the same. We're going to send it to the second fleet, and we're going to have them build a bulk transport. That's for troops. That's going to take forever. Shit, son. And then we'll just have the other planet, Obraska. They will build some more fighters. You can never have enough fighters, unless you bankrupt yourself, and I guess you have too many. Certainly. Uh, recon mission to Wustri was a success. Insight uprising mission to Charmoth has been foiled. We're going to return the view to popular loyalty. Where's Charmoth? Right here. So where the hell is the guy going back to? Okay, so Drayson's going back to Firo. I will probably forget that. Ooh, getting these orbital shipyards set up here in Commodore. Do we not have a fleet in the Corellian system? I don't think we do. Is Commodore going to be our home base here? I think so. We're going to actually transfer some of these ships, though. We'll have them do a confirmed move to Gorman. That'll take 19 days. Are you there yet? No, 316. Do we have a shipyard here? We do not. Crap. When will this guy get there? 3.30? Because I want to have everybody rendezvous, but we also need to get these broken-ass ships. Uh, less of the medium transport there, but more of the Michigan and the Caseria to a shipyard so they can repair. Alright, recon missions. First fleet has arrived at Avarum. Uh-oh. Hydra and the Serpent. I'm going to move them to Gorman. The other thing is we could go over to Balmora and try and liberate that. That might be a good idea. Alright, sweet. We've got personnel arrived at Bafash. So as you can see by the the uh, popular support meter here, they love us. Why wouldn't they? Um, but there are Imperial troops that are occupying the territory, so we're going to send these dweeb knobbers to try and destroy one of those Imperial regiments. To try and start an uprising. Shipyard idol on Kothlis. Where the hell is that? Okay, what do we have here in the Kothlis system? We do have a lot of fighters. We're okay on that, I think. Does this fleet need anything more? This is actually probably our best fleet. We're going to sell some troops to it, actually. How many troop spots do we have? Six? Certainly. Man, it's going to take forever to get these troops out there. I'm building them one at a time because they're going to come from different facilities. So that way they'll all arrive more or less at the same point in time. Because you can see some has have um, shorter or longer times to be made and shorter or longer transit times. Certainly. Apparently we don't have many troop facilities in this general vicinity. Uh, I guess we'll build just a few more fighters. We can always start transferring them around the galaxy. And we've looked all the way through the Jospro system and we have not found any signs of the Empire. 
Interesting. So we're going to have these guys go on some missions. Some recon missions. I think that's everything in the Sumitra system. As we're look Now we're just starting to look through the Outer Rim. Because we haven't like run into Vader yet. Or the Emperor. Or Admiral Thrawn. For those of you who are familiar with him. He's, a, he's more... I mean, Admiral Prawn. He's a little prawn that is cute and walks around. <laughs> hey, where was that dipshit Mon Mothma? Alright, okay, there she is trying to recruit. Sorry I went through it so fast. The sabotage mission to Befesh. Targeting the Imperial Regiment is complete. The target was not destroyed. That is the worst report ever. You're like, yeah, we thought about trying, but we failed. How about you just ruin the gun? Which of you is better at this? Espionage and combat. These are the important things. Okay, ruin the gun. The reason I'm worried about the gun... Oh, we should ruin the shield, too. Is the gun could technically shoot back and hit some of our ships if we do an orbital bombardment. All right, how long do the first fleet get here? 326. In fact, if this fleet's being built, we can just automatically tell them to send it to Uvina when it's done being built. Not bad, right? Once again, the red dots are our territories. The greens are the empires that we know of. The blue ones are neutral, and these we have no idea. Our goal has been achieved. Holy crap, you got good at recruiting. And she's like, well, we saw the thing and we didn't blow it up. Oh, both of you guys suck. We've got to do better. Alright, does Princess Leia fail to recruit? Princess Leia, recruit. I'm on my way. Uh uh Where the hell was Mon Mothma? Does anybody remember? <laughs> Cause I don't. Was it up in here? Ephira? Oh yep. Yeah. So we're gonna have her recruit. Understood. Who is this guy? What's he good at? He's good at espionage and combat. So why don't we send you to the second fleet? The second fleet doesn't have anybody. It's gonna take him forever to get there. 59 days, but he's got a job. In this economy, don't you want one? Reports! R&D reports that advanced construction yards are now available for manufacture. Uh, those are better construction yards, obviously. But we have so many construction yards we're not using right now because we've maxed out the power on a lot of our systems. I'm not really particularly worried about it. And maybe that's lazy micromanagement on my part. That's all right. So recon mission is finished. I think it was to there. Um, these are just neutral planets out there in the outer rim. So why don't we send you check out part of the aura system sector because there is a possibility that they could have bases out here in the outer room that they've gone to try and flee us so our magic number we're looking here for is 330 shipyard idol and praetis ooh that is one of our best shipyards what do we got here so we've got the very awesome third fleet Why don't we put some fighters on it? Definitely want some Y wings. I'm sorry. Unfortunately, that fleet is filled to capacity. I'm no. afraid your order cannot be carried out. Shut up. See, that's all you have to do is tell the C three PO to shut up. All right, so we got a bunch on there. Oh, this needs some Corellian Corvettes or something like that. So we'll go to Freightless and build. The reason I want Corellian Corvettes is we want something that'll be good at... Sh Ooh, Corellian Gunships! When did we unlock these? 
The Corellian gunship was designed to be two things, fast and deadly. Engines fill more than half of its interior structure, while the external, external hull mounts, likes to mount the ladies, a large number of turbo laser batteries and quad laser cannons, making it an ideal anti-starfighter platform. That's exactly what we want. We're going to build like five of them to shoot down TIE fighters. Uh, that's been deployed at price list. Oh, that's okay. That's one of these down here. That doesn't really matter right now. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. Stop, stop. Orbital bomb bombardment of Salonia. So the ruler... So where's Salonia? Salonia is down here in the Corellian system, and we don't have a fleet to defend it. So basically, they're just coming around with... I don't even know what kind of ship this is. An Imperial Dreadnought. The Dreadnought is an ancient heavy cruiser that dates from the time of the Old Republic. Standard Imperial Dreadnoughts are basically the same as the original Old Republic Dreadnoughts, except they now carry a hangar deck. A hangar dick. It's right there. It's not very big. Uh, for a squadron of TIE fighters, because of its relatively low s slow speed, even... The Imperial Dreadnought primarily serves as a convoy escort or patrol ship. But because we have no fleets in this area, uh, we have nothing to stand against them. We might have enough of a fleet at Commonor where if they came at us, come at me, bro, that we might be able to stop them. I don't know. A diplomacy mission failed. Is bombarding one of our planets. You must help them. That's not good. They destroyed one of our shipyards at Salonia. And there is nothing we can do about it. As they continue to bombard here. What do we have here? We got a shipyard. Some facilities. And there's really nothing we can do about that, unfortunately. The fleet arrives at Gorman. Yeah. Well, there's nothing we can do. The Empire is going to bombard. We're going to see that blue... The blue ticks go this way as they destroy everything on that planet. How much longer till this gets here? Four turns, and then we can have the fifth fleet join up with the first fleet here in Gorman, which is right here in the Sessawana sector. And we'll move them to Uvina. We'll move all these ships to Uvina. Well, when are these guys gonna get there? 334. Well, maybe we'll wait till they get there. Hmm. One thing at a time, I guess. The Empire is bombarding one of our planets. I know, they're going to destroy it all. What are you going to do? Corellian Core ship, or Shipyard. Shipyard Idol on Commodore. Well, what are you going to do about that, too? Oh, right here on Commodore. The Empire is bombarding one of our planets. You must help them. Yeah, we're working on it. Build as many Y-Wings as you can right here. So that if they come at Commodore, we can defend. Shipyard idle on Danab. They're going to destroy everything we have on there because there's n we'll never get a fleet there in time. The Empire is bombarding one of our planets. I know C3PO. Shut up. <laughs> I'm living it too, bro. I get it. Okay, man. I got it. It's cool. It's not cool, but what are you going to do? They're going to destroy everything on there. The Empire is bombarding one of our planets. You must help them. Yeah, sometimes you gotta learn to help yourself. Uh, let's see, delay ya. Uh... This fleet's actually pretty good right here. Delay is in the Faker system, which is right next door to Corellia. We're gonna have them help build a fleet. So we're gonna go Commodore, and we're gonna have them build two Nebulon B frigates. It's going to take a while for them to get there, but eventually we need a fleet there. The, the Empire honestly can destroy a bunch of stuff in the meantime here. Uh, do we have any idle construction yards? Not in the sector other than on Talus. Well, Talus, you're going to build to defend yourself a gun. So that if they try and bombard, you can shoot them. We got a lot of idle construction yards here, but that's not the problem. 
Oh, we do need to go back to the Bafash, right? Did these guys fit? Oh, I forgot they failed in their attempt. All right, how about y'all try and destroy the Genicore level one? Because if they destroy that, then we can try and do a planetary bombardment. It could go bad, but whatever. All right, we're going to merge these fleets. It's going to take a while for all these fighters to get here. Hmm. Wait, though, there are fighters already there. Let's start putting them on board. Oh, that's too many. Unfortunately, that fleet is filled to capacity. I got overzealous on that. <laughs> oh man. I want to go right back at Coruscant, honestly. We don't know what's there for sure fleet-wise, though. Like, the Judicator is probably still stuck there, but is the Inquisitor still there? Because this is probably old information. Let's see, how damaged is the Michigan, if we look at its status? The hull, va oh, the hull is still really damaged. So we're going to move the first fleet to Uvina. Because there is a shipyard there. In fact, we're going to build some more shipyards How there. How can I assist you? Uh, where are the shipyards? Certainly. Build some more. Oh, that's going to take forever. And then when it comes to these... How many of these guys are here? Move all of them to Uvina. And then these six guys, as soon as they show up, show up at Gorman, we're going to turn them back around and have them go right towards Uvina. Man, I want to have some more stuff built here. While well, we're building... Ooh, a Nebulon B frigate is on the way. They'll be there on day 355. Maybe when that shows up, maybe by that time we'll have our ships patched up enough where we can make another run at the capital Coruscant. That would be awesome sauce. Well, maybe if we win. If we'd lose, not so much. Well, everybody, that's going to be the end of this episode. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate everybody sticking with the LP. I love this game. I want to find the Emperor. I want to find Vader. And I most certainly want Coruscant. Until next time, take it easy, everybody.